you have seen several kinds of plants and animals well my name is sumaya from team 2 we are studying in class 8 in adarsha vidyalaya school however there are other living organisms around us which we normally cannot see wondering what they are yeah i am talking about microorganisms there yeah. so do you want to learn more about them microorganisms the smallest living organism in the world which cannot be seen with unaided or naked eyes they are only seen with my powerful my with powerful microscope there there are four types of microbes fungi algae bacteria and protozoa well virus is also a microbe but you, but it reacts and reproduce only inside the or host host bodies they microorganisms can live ranging from ice cold climate to the hot spring and desert to the marshlands means wetlands they are found in air water food and the bodies of plants animals and and humans myself akshata we are here to explain about friendly microorganisms they help in preparation of food digestion uh, cleaning of environment in the nitrogen cycle also in the fixation of nitrogen they ha- they are used to uh, antibiotic developments help in forming also myself jay shri lata each human host in microorganisms for every human cell and these microbes contribute of the immune system and detoxify harmful chemicals of course microbes are essential to make making food such as curd cheese bread alcohol and wine myself pritam we are ex- we are explain about harmful microorganisms harmful microorganisms are harmful in many ways diseases causing microorganisms are called pathogens microorganisms spoil food clothing and leather pathogens enter our body we throw the air we breathe the water we drink or the food we eat my my cells abhishek uh, microbial diseases that can spread from an infected person to healthy person through air water food or physical content are called communicable diseases example of uh, such diseases include cholera common cold chicken fox and tuberculosis myself shriyari i am here to explain about food poisoning and food preservation food poisoning food poisoning is due to the consumption of food spoiled by some microorganisms microorganisms are grown on our food and spoil our food sometimes they produce toxic substances food preservation in chapter 1 we learnt about how to preserve and store food grains you know that bread left unused unused moist conditions are attacked by fungus C- common chemicals are used to do check growth of microorganisms example common salt sugar edible oil and vinegar thank you